Hey Cruise Craze TV friends, this is Donovan Fredrickson. Uh, we're here at the beautiful port of Roatan, Honduras. Uh, wanted to take you on a trip today to visit just right off of the pier. A lot of people um, do excursions here at, at Roatan. Um, others of you may want to just get off and shop. So we're going to take you on a, a tour of the facility right off the ship. I have another video that we've done that is an excursion here uh, in Honduras that you're probably going to want to see. So be sure to follow us and then give us any comments down in the comments that comment section. We'd love to see that. Why did you get off? There's a welcome center information desk. They can answer whatever questions you might have. I know that uh, one time we got off an excursion. My wife left her phone in the cab and we went to this uh, help desk, welcome desk, and they were able to track down the tour place and to get our phone back for us. So they're very, uh, they can be very helpful to you. If you're wanting to take a, a taxi or if you're going on an excursion, this is where you're going to end up. And it's just a long, shaded, covered area. Uh, and at the end of it, if you were to go down to the end of this, there are um, some folks that will help, will ask how many are in your party, and they will help you get the size of cab that you need for your party. Very easy, inexpensive way to travel here. Another thing you can do that we have done before is to go ahead and go up. You'll see there, this dead ends to a road. If you were to go where that bus just came from, go up that road, it goes up a little hill, then it goes back down just a little ways, and you'll find just a long line of tour agencies with signs up with different types of tours. This is called a craft market. See, Honduran coffee is some of the best and uh, that's a great place for you to go. If you're trying to find a, a great gift for someone, that is a great choice for you. All kinds of souvenirs, shirts, native vases, wind chimes, cups, all kinds of things like that. Again, that is a uh, simply called craft market and it's one of my favorite places i think that you'll you would uh, get anything that you would want right there as is the case in most caribbean ports you're going to find pharmacies you can purchase just about any kind of medicine um, they have a convenience store pharmacy where you can get it just pay cash for it over the counter. Amazingly, a lot of these kind of ports have Harley Davidson shops. And uh, so here's the Harley Davidson of Roatan shop. If you're into Harleys, the Sharkies Roatan is a great little souvenir shop. Blue Mar, another one. If you want just a little bit of coffee, here's Espresso Americana. You can get your coffee fix right here. Man, it feels nice under here. It's shaded right now. As in, uh, again, most Caribbean ports, it can be scorching hot one minute and then shaded the next. So if you're one who doesn't like a lot of sun, there's plenty of opportunities here with you can see with the trees and everything to find a bench and sit there and cool off a little bit. Some of you I know are probably going to come and you want to just find you a place to get you a good drink. Um, have a little bit of, of uh, the excitement of the Caribbean vibe. And this is it over here. Here's Fat Tuesdays. If you ever, if you go to the Caribbean at all, you'll know that's one of the mainstays of the Caribbean is Fat Tuesdays. And the... Uh, the meals 
white nachos or chicken uh, quesadillas, those kind of things, are somewhere between ten and seventeen dollars um, per item. And so, you know, being in a more touristy area, that's not that overly expensive. So that's a really good night. It's, I'll just warn you, it's very loud in there. So <laughs> you might you might uh, just take that into account as well. Just a nature trail where you can wind around and see some of the some of the greenery, the beautiful lush greenery here in uh, Roatan, Honduras. And then this is something that's unique as well. This is like a ski lift. If you ever go skiing, uh, you can buy a ticket and you can get on the lift. The lift will take you up and over to a beach. Um, one thing that we have done before is uh, you can purchase an excursion uh, through the cruise line if you're on a cruise or I believe you can just go to the website their website here and uh, do that as well you can purchase um, like a package deal where you can go uh, on the on a round trip on the ski lift and then uh, over when you get on the beach it includes some uh, floats and chairs to sit in and uh, like a little clam shell I think is what they call it it's a shell that you can uh, with a cushion that you can get inside of to stay out of the heat um, and so you can spend the day over there and it's very very inexpensive uh, let me show you some of the prices over here for this right here this is where we check in In case that helps a little bit for you to get a, a, a feeling for how much that is. I'll just say you also can walk around and not take the lift. You can walk around, just get it's a public beach, you can go on the beach yourself and not pay anything at all. Uh, but it's kind of a nice little adventure uh, to go over on there. Kids love it. Like us, follow us, make comments, and we'd love to hear from you. Till next time. This is Donovan, Cruise Craze TV, bon voyage.